lose your happiness more often when you don't appreciate what you have. When you always look at the things you don't have and you become saddened and unhappy, it is not good for your life, it is not good for your spirit. I want to talk to you today about a short film produced by Program International, written and directed by Ayobami Adeboega. The title of that film is What Does She Have? What Does She Have? You know, sometimes when a man looks at another woman that is not his wife, and everything you are looking out for in that woman, you don't see it is in your wife. Meanwhile, it is there in your wife, then you have a problem. I need you to see this film. There is nothing that you are looking for outside of your wife that you can't get inside of your wife. <laughs> there is a saying that there is no one God has not done something for, except if you say your own is not enough. So I want you to please learn to appreciate what God has blessed you with. It may not be in marriage, it may be in resources, it may be in your place of work, it may be in ministry. Don't be envious of what God has not given to you. In this film, is a story about a man. You see, there is nothing that the woman did not do to please him, but he will not just look at her direction. So the question is, what does she have that your wife is not having? Or what does he have that your husband does not have? Because it goes to men and it also goes to women. I don't know what came over him recently. He stopped eating my food. And when I try to talk, he shouts at me. I can't wait to have you all to myself. For look at huh? I want you to tell me. Are you sure you are not denying your husband of sex? It's like the more I pray, the more the situation gets worsened. I must confess to you, ma. I don't know what else to do. I know what you should do. You're yeah, welcome back. Try and see that film. It's a short film on my YouTube channel. And please don't forget to subscribe. Now, before we go, let's talk briefly about the question people ask. Is it good for Christian film to go to cinema? The answer is Mark chapter 16, verse 15. The Bible says, Go ye into all the world, all the world, including the cinema, the church auditorium, the marketplaces, anywhere in the world, and preach the gospel. And if you are preaching the gospel with fames, there is no limitation to where we can go. But this is the clause I want to add to it. Anywhere God is sending you, you know that you are there or you are going there for the purpose of the gospel. If you go to church, you are going there for the purpose of the gospel. If you go to the marketplace, open crusade, you are going there for the purpose of the gospel. If you go to the cinema, you are going there for the purpose of the gospel. You are not there to copy what the people of the world do in the cinema. You are not there to showcase what they showcase in the cinema. You are going there to showcase Jesus. Anywhere you go with the motive of preaching the gospel is a place where you can preach the gospel. Until I come your way again next time, please send in your question, your contribution, your advice on this program, Gospel Fame Preview Show to me on my handles you see them on the screen you can send it to my whatsapp you can send me a message on facebook you can tweet and follow me on my twitter and i pray that the lord will bless you for it in jesus name don't forget to spread the news gospel fame is the best of all fames thank you